Oh, he's giving Rio to run for his money. Jeez. What's up, everybody? My name is Lehua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lehua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to Shenmue, and if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you'll be notified on the next upload. And if you'd like to support the channel, we got channel membership, Patreon, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to Shenmue episode 3. Oh, we're in her area now. It's sort of like she's being his narrator. And that guy who's always waiting for her. Who is he? I thought she was going to be like, how come it's not a she? <laughs> is he already trying to get rid of the competition? <laughs> Some punk who thinks he can mess with us, he did mess with you, but only because you messed with him first. Mad angels. So western sounding. Interesting name. Our house? Oh, she looks like an elegant older woman. <laughs> the little kid's like talking for him. <laughs> Mirror characters. Oh, it was kind of cold. Phone number? Jeez Louise, this is really showing the time because it's the, the phone! Gosh! Oh dang, he blew the cover. Blew the cover. Remember, warehouse eight. These guys who look like hooligans. Oh, 
Are these guys also fellow high schoolers? Oh, that was quick. Oh, you're so obedient now. Most security guards get off at seven. Yo, you are sneaking? He seems so straight laced. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear. You got caught. That sounds like that was the same voice on the other side of the phone line. The friend lives in Hong Kong. The mirror was taken. Oh, so you have, you have, have heard of this person. Cartel? Oh, gosh. Executives? Jeez Louise. But if he's one of the executives, that means he has a boss. Who's powerful enough to order him around? Jeez. Huh. They actually had them um, speaking not Japanese. One with a dragon that was sculpted in stone. Where can you start looking for the phoenix mirror? I mean, you didn't even know the dragon one existed. I'm just saying. Like, where are you gonna start? How are you gonna find it? Father and son? Uh, 
An assignment? Help Rio. So I would assume that his father was the Japanese that transported the mirror? Oh. That looked like it hurt. What? Nope, not a mirror. Oh, this was meant for him. Illicit operation. <laughs> Rio's like, what did I get myself into? I bet he knows some martial arts too. There we go. See, see, see. Oh, he's giving Rio to run for his money. Jeez. Normally, he would be able to dodge that or block it. Yeah, Rio, you almost got whooped. You need this guy to be your bodyguard. <laughs> He's like, none your business. Oh, that creepy golem looking guy. Jeez Louise. Life's been rough. <laughs> Secret room. Did dad have a secret room? College. Advice about college. Future. Marriage. <laughs> Oh. Looks like Rio is venting.
bottom of the barrel compared to those guys. He's realizing. Ooh. Looks like this is a clue. Oh, one's the crest and one's the sword. A secret room! A secret room! Very smart. Like two pieces. Like there was two mirrors and there's two pieces to get into this secret room. Looks like people haven't been in here for a while. No! Grandpa had both? Had both mirrors? Ooh, Dad looked young. So rambunctious. Phantom River Stone. They're going to try to snatch his mirror away, aren't they? But what exactly? Oh no! This guy was watching the whole time. He is like, I got you, suckers! Ooh. That guy just jumped on his leg. Like he weighed nothing. But then he's like, uh-uh, you try to jump on my leg, I kick you with it. Go get him! Press the button. You damn dogs! How is you calling them dogs? Arm smuggling and drugs. Yikes. Why would he leave without the Phoenix mirror? Aww. A uh, whole father son. Um. There's like a father son theme going on.
Wow. That just resonated with him. I bet Lan Ji thought the same thing. He wanted to become stronger. So there was a code with that message. It was of a mirror characters. <laughs> like, jeez Louise. You would think that others who were able to read Chinese would be like, huh, that looks backwards. But no, they didn't. No. Because apparently it was another form of writing that actually had a name. <laughs> so that was interesting. And I feel like they were alluding that that little kid knew someone who could speak Chinese because not only his name, but when he said bye to Ryo on that one episode where he got the soccer ball back, he said she she. So it's like, huh, that kid knows some Chinese. How come Ryo's not asking his family? <laughs> And he eventually did. So that was pretty cool. And then I like how they show the picture of Ryo's dad and his friend. And it's like, huh, Ryo's dad looked like he was a bit of a rasco. Like he went on adventures. Got into some situations. While Ryo looks like a straight laced guy. But now he's doing some uh, <laughs> sneaky stuff. He's going to do some great lengths just to uncover this mystery about his father. So I like that. And I also like how they kind of showcase that Ryo is realizing that he needs to get stronger. There are others who are stronger than him. I do like that. And I feel like they're kind of adding some character to Landi. Kind of eluding that... He's not as bad as he's as he's portraying himself. That's the feeling I'm getting. And the next episode kind of feel like, feels like we're going to be in China already. And the girl that we see in China, it seems like Ryo's going to like link up with her soon. I'm not too sure if it's going to be the next episode or the following. Oh, we'll find out. What did you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there's a Discord. Link is in the description. I also stream on twitch.tv slash Superfina. Outside of YouTube and Twitch, I host podcasts across worlds. We're talking about anime, manga, and other things you're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to the podcast is in the description. We're available on all platforms. Other than that, my name is Lehua, and this is the Superfina channel reacting to Shinmu, the animation, episode 3. Hope you guys like this video, and we'll see you on the next one. Laters!